Last year, Cathedral Catholic had to forfeit their season due to an ineligible player that participated in 10 games. This year, they returned with more fight and heart, wanting to win a section title for the seniors that didn't get the chance. After the end of last year and the way it finished up, they, they just had a lot of drive and, and desire to get back. You know, their goal was to help out that senior class last year and they want to win a CIF title for those guys. We dedicated this current season to the seniors from last year. We worked really hard and it just seems like from that, what happened last year, it really motivated us just to really step up our, step up our game this year. The Dons so far have had no problem stepping up their game beating top teams such as Vista Marietta and Jordan from Utah. However, before season started, Cathedral was the team overlooked and ranked just sixth in the San Diego prep football poll. I'm not sure why. We had a pretty good year last year, and I think we would have probably made a run if we would have had the opportunity. So, um, but that's okay. It's good to be under the radar as long as possible. I think we got a big bullseye on our backs now, but that's, you know, Again, you deal with that as it comes. Yeah, we were underestimated by all the teams we played. Our first four games were going to be the toughest. It pushes us to want to be the best, work out the best in the gym, play the best at practice. We just want to prove ourselves and prove ourselves as a team as a whole. Cathedral heads into Friday's game against Scripps Ranch, hoping to advance their record to 5-1. and one. The Falcons don't have to worry about covering just one star player but they do have to find a way to stop the one solid, balanced Cathedral Catholic football team. That's it, I think our offensive line does a tremendous job and, and you know, all three of our running backs are dangerous. Uh, again, are they a Tyler Gaffney? No, um, but that's okay. Um, our quarterback's doing a nice job and defensively, they're just such a great unit. I mean, we really took two teams that, you know, uh, the Utah team and Vista Murrieta, both top 25 teams in the country at the time we played them and uh, just did an unbelievable job defensively against them also.